Stop reacting. Grasp your emotions. Stop absorbing other people's energy and allowing it to dictate your mood. You know it's all about how you react to what's going around you. We're gonna get into that. <laughs> hey y'all, hey, it's me, Rini. In today's video, we're gonna talk about stop reacting. Stop reacting to other people when they do something, you feel like you just gotta react, react, react. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Stop letting people affect your mood and your emotions. Why, why are you putting your emotion, your emotional well-being, in the hands of other people in which you have no control over? Why do we do that? Why do we allow other people to dictate our moods, y'all? Why? Why? Why do we do that? Somebody say something or do something we don't like, and we ah, 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 we're reacting. We're giving them our power. Okay? No, don't do that. You are allowing people to control you. Get your power back. Get your power back. Get your power back. See, we have the power inside of us to control how we feel about a situation. We have a power inside of us to control our own emotions, y'all. Don't let other people's bad mood affect you. Don't let somebody else's stuff become your stuff. Get your power back. These are miserable people. These are miserable people who want to be able to control you. They want to be able to dictate your mood. But you control your mood. You control you. You have the power inside of you to control what affects you. So why keep giving that power to somebody else? Why keep giving it to somebody else, y'all? Last, be a responder, y'all. Not respond. Be, be a responder, not a reactor. A responder, not a reactor. I'm going to get into what that means. Yeah, in my last thing, to me, when you are a reactor, reactions are driven by like emotions. You might respond to a certain situation out of emotions. You could be defensive about it. You just react really quickly without too much thought. It's really emotional driven, emotionally driven. But to me, when you are responsive to something, Think about it. It's like a spinoff from being responsible. It's You have more control over yourself. You have more control over the situation. It's more considerate and deliberate. So y'all practice being a responder, responsive, instead of being a reactor. You know, that's one of the biggest things that I had to work on, and I'm still working on not being so reactive, not being so quick to speak, not being so quick to show my emotions. Rather, just take a look back, take a seat back, think about it, assess it, then respond. You know what I'm saying? So I hope that y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all did, please subscribe to my channel and I will be back with the next video.